The seven terrible training methods of Shaolin monks. Number seven, Iron Crotch Kung Fu. Iron Crotch Kung Fu is a form of martial arts that strengthens the weakest parts of the body, particularly the groin, through repeated blows with heavy logs or other objects. It is a branch of Tongbiquan Kung Fu that originated in southern China about 300 years ago. It is also known as Iron Body Kung Fu or Body Hardening. Practitioners of Iron Crotch Kung Fu use Qigong breathing techniques and mental control to counter the effects of pain and stress. However, it is not for the faint-hearted, as this martial art requires a lot of courage, discipline and endurance to endure pain. Number 6. Iron Head Kung Fu Training. Shaolin students wrap their heads with layers of soft fabric and start hitting them against a wall a few times a day, every day. It is done gently at first to avoid brain injury. The purpose of the exercise is to harden the top of the head, the forehead, and the back of the head, and strengthen the skin, muscles and bones. The practice also develops a student's internal force, and QI similar exercises are used to strengthen the eyes, nose and mouth, until the entire head becomes as hard as a stone. Number 5. Finger Punching. Finger punching is a martial arts technique that involves striking with the fingers. From a young age, Shaolin students start poking trees and wood planks to strengthen their fingers. As their training progresses, they start practicing hard strikes. Every finger on both hands must be trained to produce large bursts of strength. Upon mastery, the fingers will be strengthened enough to take on more difficult techniques. Number 4. Iron Shirt. Shaolin Kung Fu students sleep on hard beds, wrap a few layers of soft fabric around their chest, stomach and back, and massage the wrapped areas vigorously. When they're ready, they remove the soft fabric layers and start hitting the entire body with a wooden hammer at first, then with an iron one. They mobilize their QI inner energy to direct strength to the spot being hit. Iron shirt masters are able to defend themselves against heavy blows with solid and even sharp objects. Number 3. Iron Bull. Shaolin Kung Fu students first start by stabbing the stomach with a blade with their fingers and palms every day. After the skin has hardened, they continue knife scraping and deliver hard blows to their core area. When they no longer feel pain, wooden and iron hammers are used. An advanced Shaolin student would stand still while fellow students delivered blows to his stomach with iron hammers. Number 2. Monk Pillar Skill. This technique improves leg and core strength along with body balance. Monks stand on two pillars, one foot on each pillar, then sit in a squatting position with a sharp bamboo stick under them. They hold bowls filled with water, one in each hand and one atop their heads. As training progresses, the water bowls are replaced with oil lamps. Masters of this skill can remain in full balance and completely motionless for at least two hours at a time. Number 1. One Finger Kung Fu. One Finger Chan Meditation is a Shaolin technique that generates QI energy through the fingers. They also practice hard hitting with each finger to increase finger strength. They aim to achieve diamond fingers, the ability to balance their entire body weight on one finger. Monks of this Shaolin technique turn their ordinary fingers into weapons. It is considered a rare and valuable skill that requires years of hard work, patience, dedication and perseverance.